Hello! Welcome to Yami's Sport. Today, we are going to discuss a very sensitive and complicated case in women's sport. Iman Kilif, the Algerian Golden Medalist Boxer in Paris Olympics 2024. Most of us saw the combat between Iman Kelif versus the Italian boxer Angela Carini, which took only 46 seconds in fight that sparks huge controversy at the Olympics. The first punch from Kelif dislodged Karina's chin straps and the second smash against her chin and blooded her shorts. The Italian Prime Minister Giorgio Meloni also commented in media about this incident. Isn't that an unfair advantage over other women in sport? As we studied at schools, the genetics basics, each male has XY chromosome, while most women are having the XX chromosome. Some women are having XY chromosomes. Like males as an Iman Talif case, not only that, but also she has higher testosterone hormone level, which gives her much more advantage over other competitors in addition to probability of causing severe injuries to them. For that reason, the International Boxing Association president said that the DNA test had proved she had XY chromosomes and thus she excluded from World Championship last year. While the International Olympic Committee issued a statement that confirmed that said she had complied with every entry regulations and has been competing in international boxing competitions for many years in the women's category. Also, the gender and age of the athlete are, are based on her passport are okay. What testosterone level can do? Testosterone is a natural hormone that increases the mass and strength of bone and muscle after puberty. The normal adult male range rises to multiple times higher than for females up to about 30 nanomoles per liter of blood compared with less than 2 nanomoles per liter for women. In conclusion, we have two opinions, IBA versus IOC. Which of them you agree? Please let us know. Your opinion may help improving this tough sports rules to more protect sports women.